Fuzzy. Infold? Infold? Wait, I feel like I've seen like a trailer of this guy before. I don't know, something rings a bell that I've seen, seen a trailer of this. from in development game build all the content subject to change God. Bro, kind of tanky base enemy Eh, Sekiro style? Again? <laughs> Black Mid Wukong without the monkey? <laughs> okay. Bro, the way that enemy turns is so funny to me. <laughs> Still gonna be like 10 times better than Assassin's Creed sh Shadows. <laughs> no monkey. <laughs> no monkey. Just like a random dude. Looks kinda cool though. The, the world is pretty. I like the style so far. But also kinda. I feel like the enemies are a bit. Seems like a bit tanky. Ooh, you can parry as well. Okay. It was even like a perfect parry. Oh my god, oh my god. Bro, that is a cool attack. Jeez. Bro, I need a PlayStation at this point. Base enemies with like these crazy attacks. I'm kinda for it. quests in a sense and some guide points it seems world is beautiful though bro I didn't pick up the loot bro imagine playing a showcase and not picking up the loot Unbelievable. A lot of weird enemies so far. camera angle is not um, like always like this from above classic IGN move it's not IGN though it's not IGN it's PlayStation Nobu is PlayStation 
<laughs> but that is true, though. It might be like an important item, so they don't want to show it yet. Okay. Oh, that is kind of pretty. I guess she has like some sort of special effects, perhaps. Or like special abilities that, uh, that's why he's protecting her, bringing her to these places. child labor <laughs> oh okay wait okay so this this took a bit of an unexpected turn I didn't expect it to like fully transform the world okay you got like flying enemies out of that because that happened or something Tell me we're fighting that boss, though. That would be sick. Okay. <laughs> Look, they got inspired by Lords of the Fall. It's like two worlds in one game. <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> it kind of seems a little bit like it, though. Not in the same way, but... Uh, it seems like once you activate it, like, this... this uh, statue like it kind of impacts the entire world interesting yeah i really hope that uh this is what we're gonna watch I, like there has to be like a massive boss fight though if they're uh doing like a 14 minute video on this like there's there's no way there's not we got like some classic grace as well Oh, I didn't even see her first. <laughs> Bro, I really like how they actually kind of doing it as almost like a cutscene. That is crazy. Combat looks kind of cool. She also didn't. She also didn't take the chest that was right behind her. God damn it. But again, like, I feel like the base enemies are a little bit too tanky, you know, I think. That's just my opinion, though. I mean, like, maybe they tweak it before launch and stuff, but it seems a bit tanky. Like, if this is the base enemies, like, imagine, like, the, the, main, the main bosses or the boss fights. Alright, that is a cool attack. Nice. Oh, let's go! Like this has to be a this has to be a boss fight. There's no way there. This is not a boss fight. Come on, 
dragon boss fight or something. I don't think it's gonna be pretty crazy though if you're fighting like the entire thing, but let's see what happens. Ah, oh, there we go. It's not a dragon though, but it is a boss. Okay. It's actually kind of cool that they don't have a name for it either. Maybe they just don't want to spoil it. Yeah, I noticed that too. It's a good point. Ooh, perfect parry. Do you have like a special attack? No? Hmm. Interesting. Oh, oh. Oh my god, okay. He got the power of the dragon? Or black hole or whatever? <laughs> oh my god, that's a cool attack. Bro, he just parried the shit out of that. What a beast. Okay. Bro, I'm just punching it. Oh my god. Honestly, this game looks sick. It's actually interesting that you can swap the characters mid the mid boss. Oh, there we go. Okay. Why was he red? Oh my god, cutscene. Kinda. Bro, I love that. That they implemented that in the game. That's cool. Also more base enemies though. That's kinda nice. My god. Watch out. Oh, did he pull? Combat's like very creative. I like it. Okay. Nice. Huh. That might be the third guy there with the shield. Okay. Yeah,不是小家伙的血灵把我带回家，你们就全忘了。我们原本想睡着朝圣的路桥，去修。Cool skill. Nice. Okay, we got like some um, use of some bosses. Bruh. Oh my God. Ooh, look at that! Bro, that is such a cool fight. Oh my god, that is... Okay, wait, 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 wait. Got a little birdie friend? What are you telling me, birdie? Good job, birdie. It's not a bird anymore, it's a butterfly. And now it's a fish. Ah, oh, okay, now it's a flower. Almost though, close. PlayStation. Not gonna lie, that looks freaking incredible. Oh my god. Like, PlayStation kind of hit it out of the park with that one. Like, 
it, it's not a lot of games like that where I've been like, that looks good. Like the loot, the world, the combat. My kind of game for sure. Good timing that we have. Um, let me see what it says though. Take a first look at extended gameplay footage of Ballad of Antara, an upcoming action RPG from Info Games in development for PlayStation 5. So we don't really know when though. Nah, it's still early. It doesn't say yet. It doesn't say. Doesn't seem like it is. It has a release date yet. Yeah, that's that's the thing like where I'm noticing here as well. Like those standard enemies are some serious damage punches. They don't seem overly challenging. They just take too long to take out. Yeah, that's 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 a little bit what I'm thinking as well. It it's one of the things that I noticed. It just seems like it will be very annoying if you have to fight like the base enemies like for so long. Uh, but yeah, it doesn't doesn't seem like it has a release date yet. Let's see if it says anything uh, on the PlayStation side. Uh, 2025. Three online players as well. Okay, that's kind of cool. Online play. Uh, 2025, so sometimes next year. Sometime next year. I guess it's time to get the PS5 then, boys. 30th Anniversary Edition. And then we get this game, Ballad of Antara. Uh, 